morning everyone well or is it already evening there let me greet you with the, the languages I have known since I have been in the Sulad's ministry Mopian Marosilom Kantaulin Musulad for the Manobos and for the Samal Ahap Sangom Makaam Kamemon Sagadanakan Marayao Doom Taimanghod for the Tausugs and uh, for us here in behalf of my team here in Thailand Sawadee Kap uh, This video is a report of what uh, we have uh, done here and um, we will be uh, showing you thus far what, uh, to what extent that Sulad Thailand have been uh, doing and God is very gracious to us here in Thailand you know that Thailand is more than 95% Buddhist people and uh, it just makes sense that we always hear this, this saying why preach the gospel twice when in fact there are people who haven't heard it once this is a rare opportunity for for all of the missionaries here and so I would like to begin with our project in Wi-Fi we have now assigned two Sulas missionaries in the person of Mom Anna and also Mom um, Elma Gay. And I believe that, that God has used them mightily in their work. They're in Wi Fi um, village. They have already uh, known how to, to speak to the people, they have lived there, and, and in fact, we have already fruits of our labors there. That's why the Sulads had um, proposed two baptisms and uh, now there is uh, one very influential person which is needed to be brought into our prayer. He is the only professional um, teacher in, in the village and he is very influential to the village and once he will submit and accept God through baptism, I believe that many many other Wi-Fi people you know, men people will will come to accept um, our Lord Jesus Christ through baptism Thailand is opportunity for missions and I believe that God is opening a lot of doors now here in, in Thailand and we are talking about expanding territories um, opening new villages in in the north in the mountain tribes and also in the south where we have our Muslim brothers and sisters there we need your help we need your support we need missionaries to, to work with us here thank you very much and may God the father of Abraham and the father of us all bless us Have lots of opportunities somewhere else better than here but why you choose to sacrifice and live among the Mian people in Hoi Phai? Mm. I am here because um, it's very hard to refuse God's call. Mm -hmm. mm. The people here really need a savior. So here I am. I I'm trying my best to share what I have for God's glory. I know you have lots of challenges, but what's the hardest? The hardest one is to speak their language. Mm -hmm. And it's very difficult to, to speak words with Mm -hmm. Six stones. That's mm -hmm. why you need to be very careful with your accent. Mm -hmm. But I could see that you're improving a lot. How far have you gone with your language acquisition? By God's grace, I can connect to people now and praise God for that um, mm -hmm. I am using his wisdom mm -hmm. so thank you very much
first week. Yeah, it's very challenging, but God is really good. Yeah, He's always good. A man, yeah. how do you say farming man? Day, 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 day. Okay, but I actually learned yeah, by phrase. Mm. So how about if I'll say I'm going to the farm? Why you choose to be here in, in Thailand to work among the Mian people? I grew up in a Christian family and my parents taught me about Jesus and His love. Mm -hmm. So I feel responsible to be here because mm -hmm. here there are a lot of children who don't know Jesus and His love for them. Mm -hmm. Thank you for that. I know you have lots of challenges, you know, it's not only every week but it's every day. Mm -hmm. But what's the hardest? Personally, what's the hardest? As a teacher by profession, it is my goal to bring our dear children to Jesus. Mm -hmm. In a simple language, mm -hmm. I have to speak the words of truth to them. Mm -hmm. But the greatest challenge I ever face is to speak their language, for me mm -hmm. to show that there is Jesus and He mm -hmm. loves them so much. <laughs> Personally, is it really hard to learn the main language? Yes, it is. It's very hard because it is a unique tonal language. Mm -hmm. So, how far have you gone now in your learning? Because you are required to submit language report every month. So, how far have you gone now? Mm -hmm. By God's help, I cannot start communicating with the people around. Amen. Thank you very much. Teacher Andy, yeah. what is it like to serve as a missionary volunteer? It's interesting and inspiring for me to teach the children here. And I'm happy to see them singing, mm -hmm. reciting some Bible verses, finger plays, and listening to the Bible stories. And it's been a great privilege for me to share God's love through teaching with the children. What is your impression? People are receptive to change. Mm -hmm. um, compared with their situation a year ago, they really have changed for betterment. They have applied what the volunteers taught them. Mm -hmm. So, thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> What is it like to serve as a volunteer? Self-fulfillment. Mm -hmm. Seeing the villagers' gratefulness after medical service, mm -hmm. coming to the center or visiting in their homes is a self-fulfillment for me as a nurse. Mm -hmm. There is no such joy I ever felt than sharing and making a difference in the life of me and villagers. Mm -hmm. As a nurse, what does the village need? In health aspect, Wi-Fi village needs medical supplies, mm -hmm. especially for children with cough and colds. And most importantly, mm -hmm. they need someone to teach them proper healthy lifestyle, uh, personal hygiene, mm -hmm. and most of all, environmental sanitation. Mm -hmm. So thank you very much. You're welcome.
ดังจากมีอาสาสมัครเข้ามาในหมู่บ้านนี้เป็นยังไงบ้างครับก็หลายอย่างเปลี่ยนแปลงไปในทางที่ดีขึ้นโดยเฉพาะเด็กๆได้เรียนภาษาอังกฤษกับครูต่างชาติโดยตรงแล้วก็ชาวบ้านก็รู้จักดูแลตัวเองขั้นพื้นฐานดูแลสุขภาพขั้นพื้นฐานของตัวเองและเวลามีปัญหาก็เขาก็จะมาปรึกษานี่ได้มีที่ปรึกษาเกี่ยวกับสุขภาพให้เขาครับหมู่บ้านนี้จําเป็นต้องมีอาสาสมัครไหมครับคิดว่าจําเป็นต้องมีครับเพราะว่าชาวบ้านที่นี่ก็ต้องการให้ต้องการอาสาสมัครมาพัฒนาที่นี่แล้วก็มาให้การศึกษากับเรื่องสุขภาพกับชาวบ้านที่นี่คนที่นี่ต้นข้าวครับว่าคือผลกระทบที่คุณได้เห็นเกี่ยวกับการมีมิชชันนารีบริวารในชีวิตของชาวบ้านเป็นโอกาสดีที่จะเรียนภาษาอังกฤษกับชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวบ้านชาวบ้านที่นี่ในที่นี้ชาวน่าจะยันเปียตายบุหายนงหายถึงตู้อีบุญยงยงซ้ำหายอีบุหายนงเหี้ยวตู้นี่บุหายตู้มบุหายยาวอีบุหายเท่าทิ้นหูเหี้ยวว่า
confronted with a strange situation. A strange story. With a strange challenge. Thank you.